Hello and welcome back to WeBC. Are you experiencing pesky roadblocks when trying to install Discord, specifically an annoying JavaScript error? Well, then this video is for you. Over the past week, we have made quite a few videos on common Discord errors and they have been received very, very well, so we thought we would put together a few more. In this video, we will show you how to fix the errors which are stopping you from installing and using Discord. So firstly, like many other programs, Discord continuously stores temporary data on your PC to help it run as efficiently as possible. Sometimes those temporary files can become corrupt and interfere with the way the program runs. So in order to give Discord a clear run when booting up with your system, we need to delete these specific files. We can do this by following these simple steps. Start by closing Discord via Task Manager, this is Control Alt Delete. Next go to your Windows search bar and type run and press enter. A small run window will pop up and in the open field typing the following command, percent app data percent and then click run. A window should now appear with several folders inside, select the Discord folder, right click it and delete. Once deleted, return to the start menu again and load run once more. This time type in percent local app data percent in the same field and click run. Once again find the Discord folder and delete it once again. Now you can relaunch Discord setup file and follow the steps provided to reinstall the software. This method has worked for so many and is one of the most common causes of the JavaScript error message. Hopefully this will work for you, However, if not, we have a few more ideas to try. It's been very well documented that certain antivirus apps have been known to target specific Discord installation files and effectively stop them during the install process. What this means for Discord is that the software can no longer access the files to complete the process. It's at this stage you will be notified of the fatal JavaScript error message. The most common file which falls victim to the antiviral bombardment is the Discord underscore voice recovery file. There's an easy way to resolve this issue and it requires a simple antivirus bypass. For this, you need to enter into your quarantine vault within the antivirus software you are using. For this example, we're going to download and install Avast to show you how it's done on the free application. So in Avast, we have a protection tab, and inside we see a series of sub-options. So we're going to locate the virus chest. Sometimes this is called the quarantine area in other antivirus software. In this antivirus chest, you can see that all the files which the antivirus software has deemed unsafe. Avast in this case has quarantined those files. This is where we have to go in and restore them. So in your quarantine folder, locate any files which are associated with Discord. All Discord related files will have Discord in the name, so it's very easy to see. Once located, click those files and select restore and add exception. Do this for all files related to Discord and once complete, restart the installation process. Even if you manage to install Discord successfully, you can still experience the JavaScript error. If this does occur, the easiest way to resolve the issue is to reinstall the program. Uninstalling a program is quite simple, as I'm sure you're aware. However, we will need to fully erase all files to allow for a clean install second time round. To do this, start by going to your Windows search bar and searching for Control Panel. Once in Control Panel, you will see a series of options. Find the Programs tab, and then underneath the heading, you will see Uninstall a Program. Click the shortcut. You will need to see the list of programs that are currently installed on your system. Find Discord, select it, and click Uninstall. Once uninstalled, go to the Start menu again and select Run. Type in the open field, percent app data percent once again and click run. Locate the Discord folder and delete it. Reopen run once more and type percent local app data percent and again delete the Discord folder you find. You will now need to re-download the installer from the Discord website. Once downloaded, simply reinstall the program. Discord should install fine without any JavaScript errors. So there you have it, those are the most common ways of fixing that annoying JavaScript error you sometimes get when using or trying to install Discord. Let us know by leaving us a comment in the comment section below and we'll get back to you if we can answer the question. If this video did help you at all, we would love if you could leave a like on the video, subscribe to the channel, hit that notification bell so you never miss an upload and we'll see you in the next one.